Hello, my name is Michael Driscoll, and in this tutorial, we will be learning how to put images into Debix Python title bars. So it would probably help if we actually started out by creating an application that uh, just shows you what it looks like normally when you run um, Debix Python. So let's start by creating a frame. We'll call my frame. We'll just use uh, the frame object. And let's go ahead and put our init in here. Self, it's probably good. And uh, then we'll do WX frame and we'll initialize it. And let's make this a little bit bigger. Okay. So our frame doesn't have a have a parent. We'll call it. Um, image extraction for now, even though we're not going to get to that first. And then we'll add a panel. Well, we don't even need a panel, do we? We just need to show it. Okay. And last but not least, we need to add our startup code. So if name equals main, we will create an app object. So app equals wx.app faults, because we don't want it to redirect. Okay, and then we create our frame, which equals my frame. So now we have our frame instance. And lastly, we want to start up the main loop, which is our event loop. Okay, so if we run this, what you see is just kind of a generic uh, image here. That's not really what we want. We kind of want to put our own image in. That's the whole point of this tutorial. So to add an image, um, we'll, let's try adding like the Python image to it. So one way to add an image is to just extract it from an executable because a lot of executables have an icon embedded in them. So one way to do that, you can do icon location, just a Debix Python class, and we can pass it an executable. So let's import sys, which is something which is a Python module. If you do, oops. Gotta put it in the right spot. All right, sys dot executable. That'll grab the Python executable, and we'll be able to extract the image from it. Then to add it to the the frame, you have to call set icon on the frame object, and you have to pass it a Debix icon object. So we will pass it one of those. And now, if we run this code, we should get something a little bit different our icon. So now we have this kind of a Python icon. It's kind of hard to see on the video, but if you were to zoom in um, on the on a screenshot, you'd see there's a little Python logo there on top of kind of a terminal thing. That's kind of what you see when you load up idle or show the idle program. Let's see if you go to idle. It has kind of this same look to it. It's not quite the same, but it's very similar to this logo here. So that's the first way to do it. Let's find out another way to add an icon. All right, so let's go ahead and modify this code just a little bit to use that icon that we were just looking at. So I have an icon saved on here. Um, it looks kind of, like kind of the Python logo. Um, let's open it up in Paint so you can see what it looks like. So you can see it over here, it's really tiny. This is gonna be our 16 by 16 pixel uh, icon that we're gonna stick into our, into our Debix Python program. So the code is very similar, except this time we're going to um, create an icon. Instead of doing icon location, we'll just do this. So wx.icon, we'll pass it our py ico file, which you'll see is saved in, right next to this file. And then we're going to tell it that um, we don't know exactly what uh, file type it is, even though we do, but let's pretend that we don't. We'll say bitmap type any. And that just will make uh, Debex Python attempt to find a way to load it. So it's going to look at this and it'll eventually figure out that it's an ICO file, an icon file, and it'll load it into our icon. And then we'll have exactly what we want. So now we can just replace this code here with our icon code, with our icon object, I mean. And then we can just rerun this code. And if everything works correctly, we now have the, you know, the icon I was showing you earlier from Python. 
that you see for, for when you load up idle. So this icon here is now our icon in our title bar. So now you know two different ways to uh, put an icon into your uh, Debrix Python title bar. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments. Otherwise, I'll see you next time.